Dear friends, welcome back to Automate with Rakesh. In this video, we are going to learn a new concept which is skip while and take while. And for this, I have prepared a simple question which is going to clarify all your understanding around these two methods. Look at the question. As a UiPath RPA developer, you are tasked with identifying the silver star performers from the given student's data table. So this is your data table. You can prepare a similar data table. Doesn't have to necessarily have all the data rows. You can create some five to 10 values in your Excel. So this is your student's data table. Use UiPath link to perform the following tasks. I mean, link query in UiPath to perform the following tasks. What are this? These are important points. How will you write the query or which is the right query? Short the students by their marks in ascending order. First, you will short it. So for that, you will be using the order by method. B, skip students with marks less than 80. So here you would skip the marks which are less than 80 and then take students until you encounter a student with marks less than 90. So that means it is giving you a range 80 and 90. Within this range, you have to find your data table. Your output should be a data table which should contain student marks between 80 to 90. And this is how your current table looks like. So how will you achieve this in link? This will be very interesting and a lot of learning you will get. So let's move on to UiPath Studio and learn in detail. The very first thing I will show you my Excel file. In the sheet number six, I have kept all these marks of students. And in the sheet number eight, I won't, would like to print the output. So for that, in the studio, I'm using the Excel process scope and reading the sheet number six and storing that to a variable called students DT. And below, I'll be writing that to sheet number eight, the output data table. So these are the two data table variables that we are using. One is your students data table and the output data table. One is the input, the other one is the output. So let's see, how will you write the link query? I'm going to click here on this assign activity and let's write one by one. So what is your input data table? Students DT. Dot as innumerable. The very first task is you have to order by. Okay, so put a dot and then say order by. So this will order in ascending order. If you write order by descending, it does it in descending order. So order by and here I will write the lambda function function of x and x which column contains your marks the marks column ensure if you have written mark as a title not marks. So be careful there is a s here exactly I'm writing that x dot x marks. So here it will order. So for that I will convert this to integer. OK, I'll convert this to integer and close the parenthesis. All right. Now, first, let's see the output of this. Copy to data table. So this is your let's see the output. So what is the very first code we have written? This I am just ordering in the ascending order. This is the ascending order. So the very first thing we have done this after that, we have to continue with couple of other queries, right? So let us first save it and run this. Now let's see after applying order by what happens to the data table. Use Excel. I think I've kept it in edit mode. Run this. Okay, so the execution is complete. Let me go here. Now, if you see what happened in the sheet number six, all the different different numbers were there. Now in the sheet number eight, it has been ordered in the ascending order. If you see, okay, completely in the ascending. Uh, 11352. If you see it here, 11352. From here, it has gone to the top. Okay, so now we have done the order by. After doing the order by, next thing is what I will do. I'll skip which are less than 80 that is our criteria right less than 80 so it will skip all these rows until here so for that how will you write the condition let's go back it 
and here let's continue so let me remove the copy data table from here now after that put a dot and then you have to write your next this one is skip while so when you have to write multiple such lines i have taught you one simple method what you have to do simply put a space and write a underscore so this tells ui path that it is continuation of your link code okay so put a space and underscore and then write your next thing so what is your next thing you want to skip while and then you will write a condition let me tell you how this skip while works okay point number 2 let us understand how this skip while works so the meaning is pretty simple it will it will continue to skip until the condition is true until the condition is true it is continue to skip so here if i put less than 80 so what would happen it will skip this it will skip this because it is less than 50 right until the condition is true it is continue to skip 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 and wherever it will reach less than 80 where the condition will become false it will stop here that is how the skip while works it will skip anything less than 80 until the condition is true it will continue to skip the work of that is to skip so it will continue while the condition is true what i will do i will copy this entire code until here and paste because every method requires a lambda function i have written that and here what i will do after converting that marks i will put here it should be less than 80 so what would happen when i write less than 80 it will check until this condition is true it will continue to skip so here i am writing less than 80 so if i go here to the table first it has ordered and then it will skip this because it is less than 80 condition is true condition is true it will continue to skip 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 until here here the condition will become false so it will stop in the 10th record getting it now let's see how the output is coming for that simply use copy to data table okay so this is our next code we have written so let me put that on to the notepad okay and let us save it and run it so before running ensure the sheet 8 I'm, i should clear it save this and run so now what i am expecting it will have the values anything which is greater than 80 in my data table okay execution complete now let's if you go here if you see it has stopped anything which was greater than 80 has been skipped so until the condition was true until the condition is true it was skipped everything and finally we got this output okay now i i don't want everything i want until 90 so i want until so i have to put another condition where it will skip the rest of it and only take this many right where the mark is less than 90 because it's a silver award it is a silver award so it is 80 to 90 whoever has achieved 80 to 90 they will get that award now for that we will add one more method here we'll continue the code so let me remove the copy data table and here i have to give a space underscore so that you can continue the code and here you can write just to make improve your readability of your code you are doing this okay putting the underscore the next thing take while there is another condition called method called take while now what this take while does the third point is take while again take while works in the similar fashion it will take the values until the first one I was skipping it will take it will have that values until the condition is true getting it so here just the opposite of it but works similarly what you do you copy this entire code and paste it here and only thing you have to do is change the value to 90 so it will continue to take until the value is less than 90 now if you look at your table it will take this because the value is less than 90 condition is true it will take this it will take this it will take this take this take this take this but this will not take it so it will stop here so that means your output come from here to here your output will come from this to this let's go back and here let us write copy to data table okay let's save this so this is our final code
okay now let me run this done save it and let us run it okay before running i should have i suppose to clear the data because we will not get the output properly right so let me clear the data in the sheet number 8 save it run it again okay so now the execution is complete let's go back to sheet number eight and this is your final data okay so we have got all the silver stars who have scored between 80 to 90 range so you understood how your final code has been written and you have got the understanding of the entire meaning just remember just remember skip while will only work until the condition is true if you put a greater than here then everything will change so remember applying this lower symbol smaller than or greater than is important so here uh, if you have an understanding how it works then you know what kind of a condition you have to put there so both this take while and skip while works based on the condition written inside them as per the condition until the condition is true it will skip until the condition is true it is going to take that is the summary of this video so thank you guys for watching we are going to come up with more such interesting contents Continue to watch my videos and give it a like to them and do subscribe to my channel in case you have not done it already. Thank you for all your support till now. We are going to meet once again in the next content.